Hi guys, Kate Freeman here with another Lester story. <clears throat> Pardon me. So today I wanted to talk about one time when I went out to lunch with Lester. And it was just the two of us. We went to a, I think it was a Denny's near the office. And we sat and talked for a long time. And I was kind of excited because I thought, oh, I get to buy Lester lunch. You know, when a group of us went, he always insisted on paying for his own lunch. And once in a while, he would let somebody buy lunch for a group of us, but usually we all bought our own lunch. And I was so excited that I would get to buy Lester's lunch because it was just the two of us. So we talked and talked and he started talking about how people always felt like they needed to buy him lunch. <laughs> and he talked and talked about it, how people just felt like they should buy him lunch. And, you know, he said, I can buy my own lunch. I mean, I, I have money. I can buy my own lunch. And, of course, I'm just really excited about buying Lester's lunch. And at the time, I was working in the office at the Institute, so I wasn't making much money, and he knew that. And so he was being protective and also teaching me that I didn't have to have to buy his lunch. But there was something in me that just had to buy his lunch. <laughs> so we got up to the to the to the cash register after it was that kind of place. You go to the cash register to, to leave. And uh, I said, Lester, I just really want to buy you lunch. So he just stepped back and very generously let me buy his lunch. And um, I did learn from it, but it was such an important thing for me that day to buy his lunch and he was sweet enough to let me. So that's today's story. It's a short one, but I hope you enjoy it. Lots of love. Talk to you soon. Bye.